Hey guys, so we are making some slightly authentic lasagna. That's for my meat. I got my pasta water warming up, and then this is for the bechamel sauce. Start by browning your ground beef. While the meat is cooking, we're going to chop this onion. Like so. Okay. Meat is ready. I'm going to drain it. Okay, so add the onion with a little bit of oil. I added two teaspoons of minced garlic. Fry this up a bit. Add your meat back in. Some seasoned salt. Some garlic salt. Some black pepper. A little bit of chicken bouillon. Mix, mix, mix. These are my two favorite sauces. Three cheese and roasted garlic herb. We're going to use both of them. Yes, I know Raul's is better, but broke bitch, my mother four. Ain't got it. We getting prego. So I poured some heavy cream in my jar. I don't put water, sorry. I put heavy cream. Okay, stir that in. Excuse the loudness over here. Like I said, mother of four. So let that come to a simmer. We're going to add our lasagna noodles, pasta, whatever you want to call it. I did forget oregano. There it is. Drain your noodles, but make sure when you do cook them, they're al dente because they finish cooking when they're in the oven. Okay, let's start the bechamel sauce. Start by melting four tablespoons of butter. Okay, once this is melted, you're going to add some flour. One fourth cup of flour. Whisk this well for 30 seconds. Okay, move the pot back to the heat, put it on low, and you're gonna start whisking in the milk. So it's a total of three and a half cups, but we're gonna do one cup at a time. And then whisk until the flour and butter is well incorporated. Okay, once all the milk is in and there's no more lumps, you can increase the heat to a medium and cook for about six to seven minutes until it starts to thicken. Okay, when this is done, remove from the heat and add one cup of Parmesan. Oh, yeah. If the sauce is too thick, add some more milk. But I like this the way it is. Stir that in. Add a little salt. Some pepper. Mix and come back for part two. Preheat your oven to 350. Yes, I am using an aluminum tray today. You're going to pour about a cup of your meat sauce on the bottom. You're going to pour two cups of your meat mixture over the pasta. Make sure it covers the pasta completely. We're going to pour one cup of the white sauce over the meat. So layer with mozzarella. Add another layer of sheets and repeat the process. I don't have fresh parsley, but this dry sucker would do. But look it. Oh my goodness. Okay, so bake for 25 minutes or until a little bit golden and bubbly. The lasagna is done. So now we're just waiting for our garlic bread. No, I didn't make the garlic bread homemade, but look at how beautiful. <gasps> Can't wait to dig in. First reaction. I'm not hungry yet, but they're trying it out. Olive Garden who? Olive Garden who? Like for real for real. Like it's this, good, like, huh? Like this time it's way better. Like, yes. What cheese did you use? A lot. Like this time, Sherry, this time is. <laughs> Wait, you gotta try it now. Dang, Kiki. You don't even, like, after this, you don't want to go back. So, I did. No, who? Let Kiki Olive try. Garden. Okay. All right, Connor is about to try some. Who's gonna help you? Look at that. Good? Yeah? The reveal. Look at that. It's perfectly layered. So delicious. Mukbang on my YouTube channel.